It's SkyFrost95 here today reviewing a travel umbrella. Now it might seem really strange that I'm reviewing such a commonplace item, but umbrellas actually have quite a bit of variation coming down to the structure, the size, and the strength. Having a trusty umbrella, it can definitely be a lifesaver. So let's go ahead and take a look at this one. So this one's a little bit bigger than other travel umbrellas that I have. For instance, this one here is a good length shorter than the just about 13 inches of this length when it's completely folded down. But it has the same mechanism as most umbrellas these days, this really quick button that will immediately release the umbrella and then press it again to quickly collapse it. This is definitely a mechanism that I look for in all of my umbrellas because it makes it so easy if you're in a downpour to say get in and out of your car in a breeze. Just remember to completely collapse it when you're finished otherwise you press it again it won't have the force to open up the umbrella when it's actually fully extended. For other design elements, the handle here has a nice grippy surface and it has grooves that align perfectly with your hand so it's very ergonomic. It's also very sturdy, if not I'll be a little bit heavy because of the size. It also features 10 ribs as opposed to the traditional 8 which means it is much more rim proof and will less likely be overturned by strong winds. When fully expanded, the wingspan of this umbrella is approximately 43 inches so it's a little bit bigger than a typical personal umbrella. With the more folds comes a little bit thicker build, so I kind of wish that the strap that they used to keep all things in place was a little bit longer. I found it sometimes a little bit difficult to strap it back up. And once you've opened the umbrella once, don't even bother trying to stuff it back in the included skin tight sleeve. At the end of the handle, there's also this elastic strap that you can use to easily put it around your wrist when you're carrying it around. Or you can use it to hang it, say, on a doorknob to let it dry. So all in all, I think this is a fantastic travel umbrella, albeit it is a little bit bigger than most, but it's still able to fit in, say, the side pocket of your backpack. It may not fit in some perches, but I think the sturdiness of it really makes up for the bigger form factor. Again, I'll always put the link to the cheapest price available on Amazon in the description. Thank you for watching this video. If you found it helpful, please give it a like. It'd be greatly appreciated. And make sure to subscribe to my channel, SkyFirst95, if you haven't already, to get more content like this. Or if you're watching this on Amazon, head over to my channel URL right here, or just search it up on YouTube, SkyFirst95. There you'll see a bunch of my product reviews and unboxings. Feel free to browse. Or if you want to search for something specific, just hit that search field. That'll do it for this video. This is SkyFirst95. Thanks for watching.